Welcome to another edition of Avery Dennis and Reflective Tips and Tricks, Traffic Jet 101. Today we're going to walk through the basics of the FlexiPrint DX design software. The process to convert an existing design file into print from the spot colors is extremely simple. I'm going to walk through a couple examples here that have to follow a little different process. So for the first one, let's go ahead and simply open our file. So the first one here is the Frostwood, so it's Frostwood Drive. And this right now is set up to print just standard off of the CMYK colors. So you can see the background is just a standard green, and you've got the, the city logo here. So if I go ahead and right-click on the background, so go to Select, and select similar color. You'll see it shows the green shade it's currently designed to print from. We want to change this to, to print from spot 4, which is where our, our spot green is currently located. So you see now, all of a sudden, the background color has changed, and this is ready to be printed because we want to maintain the colors that are built into the seal here. So this is going to print from CMYK, while the background is going to print out of the spot colors. So it'll give you your long-term durability. So if you go ahead and click File, you can click Rip and Print to print it directly from here. Or if you want to save it and batch it with other jobs later on, simply click Export and save it as an EPS file. So the other example I have here is an interstate shield. The only difference is this file has a mask built into it. So let's go ahead and click Unmask. So right click on the image, click Unmask. And you see all of a sudden you have this black box come to the front. But right now everything is selected. So let's click off of there and simply select the black box. If you delete that, now you can click the background just as you had before. Select similar color and change this to spot 8. So it prints from the, the blue spot color. And right click, same thing for the red here. So select similar color. And we're going to change this to spot 5. And this, you can do the same thing, either rip and print directly or export it as an EPS to, to batch later with other jobs. But you can see it's a very simple, easy process to convert your existing sign library over.